everyone, hope you guys are doing well. So, welcome to New World. Um, so, this is my character. I don't know, like, how many videos or what I'm gonna do with this, but I started playing it. It was a suggestion, I think, from a few people, and it's been something that I was, like, intrigued about trying. Um, I've literally, literally only got, like, 30 minutes in the game. We're gonna load it up and I don't know like I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> in the game um so yeah we're just gonna have like a roam around and stuff okay so yeah um I literally have like kind of no idea what I'm doing literally no idea um so this is as far as I've got I have to speak to this guy so we're gonna we're gonna speak to him together. Steady there, friend. Dying can be a rather harrowing experience the first time one goes through it. You're actually looking quite healthy, all things considered. <laughs> Luckier than most. Uh wait, am I dead? Not any more, but <laughs> you were very much dead for a few minutes there. You've been resurrected, you see. It's quite a lot to take in, I know. You'll find many strange things on Eternum, and this not dying business is one of them. Okay, uh, I'm hearing voices too. Yes, the nice. pole of the corruption. It's that damn storm. I can't even count the number of ships it's wrecked. And every sailor coming ashore is corrupted. You're one of the few who came through with your soul intact. Okay, so coins in here are also capped. Which is a bit weird, but... Ah, but I forget my manners. Watch a lace and reese at your service. I watch these shores for shipwrecks and help those like yourself. <laughs> You're undoubtedly quite shaken by all of this, and probably famished too. <sighs> Resurrection is taxing on the soul and the body. Um, okay, uh, do you have uh, food and supplies? <sighs> Unfortunately, we don't keep the watchtower very well stocked. Bring your own mead is the rule. But there are some nice fat boar roaming around nearby. Of course, you're not exactly equipped for hunting, are you? I mean, I think I killed a boar when I was just like messing about for like five minutes. Uh, what equipment do I need? Yes, okay, you'll nice. need a skinning knife to start. Unless you prefer your roasted boar with the skin on. If you'll gather some flint and wood on your way to join me at the watchtower, you can fashion a crude knife at the campfire. Okay. Right, I don't know if I have some stuff. That's obviously not my inventory. How do I get into my inventory? Tayab. Um, yeah, I collected some stuff, so I guess I have ten. And I have eight flint. Can I wear these? I can. Okay. So yeah, this is in my character, by the way. Doesn't she look kind of cute? She look kind of cute. Uh, let's grab some flint. Well, I'll just grab all of it. I don't know. When I need it at a later date, maybe. Don't know. And let's craft. Uh. Crafter, flint, knife, okay. Uh, this thing. Uh, pin recipe, let's craft. Uh, continue to craft, salvage, uh, continue. Okay, let's escape. Uh, speak to him. Very impressive. Nice. One of the nicest crude skinning knives I've seen. <laughs> You've Did you see? done this before, haven't you? I bet he said that to the other guy, right? Okay, can the glass. Nice. Right, so I got it's some important gloves. to know how to provide for yourself here. The wilds of Eternum can be a very harsh environment. It's reasonably safe up the road in the town of Corinth, but out here, we are on our own. Uh, is that the town you come from? Yes, it has its own share of troubles, but nothing like what we are seeing here. The persistence of this storm is worrisome, to say the least. 
I may very well need your help, but as I promised, we need to get you fed first. Uh, Alright, where do I find these balls? Uh, yes, you'll find them snuffling around in the bushes nearby. They're ornery, but I think you can handle it. Go and hunt yourself down a fat one, skin it, and cook yourself a little feast at the campfire. Alright. Let's first off, let's pop these globbies on. Yeah, I got no idea what this stuff is. <laughs> um, right, so let's go, let's go kill a boy. I see one over here, a nice fat, juicy one. Hi, boy, boy, boy. Wait, what is this? Wait, how do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Okay, there's one here. Uh, no equipped knife. How the bloody hell am I supposed to equip it? Yeah? Okay, cool. Nice. Can I get more? Do you think I should, do you think I should kill more? I think maybe kill this one too. <laughs> Take these berries. Just inside my ball. Don't worry about me. <laughs> Let me know if any of you play this. I mean, as I said, I'm pretty confident, unless I was literally imagining it or I dreamt it or something. I'm pretty sure it was a suggestion a couple of times. So let me know if you play. Because any helpful tips would be appreciated. Um, so, I have to cook. Okay, so we've got recovery food, we've got light ration. Um, do you think I can craft? Should we craft four of them? Just so we've got some food. Uh, our cooking has leveled up. I'm guessing that's what that is. Let's exit. And speak to my gosh, look at this guy's hair. Oh, he looks cool! I hope people can't hear me. <laughs> that smells delicious. <laughs> and you, you seem to be feeling better than when you first rejoined the ranks of the living. <sighs> That's convenient. Because I really do need your help to make sure the threat here on the shore is contained. Okay. <laughs> we get shipwrecks on these shores now and then. But I've never seen anything like this. The storm. All these ships, and the fact everyone's corrupted except you? Well, we have to do something. Uh, what does it mean to be corrupted? That's the dark side of eternal life, I suppose. You resurrected with your soul intact, but many come back soulless, the lost. Or worse, they return with their souls twisted, possessed by insatiable evil. Those we call the corrupted. Uh, possessed like by a demon? Essentially, yes. And the corrupted are relentless, destroying and killing to increase their numbers. Looking at the wreckage of your ship, I suspect that's what's become of the rest of your crew. Lovely, thanks. The ship I arrived on, where is it? It's just across the water, and frankly, we need to deal with the corrupted gathering there. I know it's not a pleasant task, but if you can put down some of your former crewmates, it's a start, at least. Okay, I'll do it, oh, yes. <laughs> excellent! If the corrupted start converging on you in numbers, I suggest you retreat. Either way, keep that blade handy. The last thing we need is for you to be joining their ranks. Okay, what is this? An army like this piece has many scratches and so uh, what does it do? Uh, could I just like sell it? I don't know where we gotta go, but I'm gonna change my pants out. Um Are these better? They're not better. Should we salvage them? Or would it be better to sell them? Do they sell for anything? Or should we salvage them? What does salvage do? 
Uh, return? Uh, yeah, sure. Should I equip this? Uh, okay, number three. So I eat this to recover my health, I'm guessing. So I have to kill my friends. So there's no like sprint. Wait, they what is it? shall ruthlessly strike down their fellows, their path to corruption begun. Okay. There's a sprint, I don't think I need any more sprint. Okay, so this is a crewmate here. I need to kill five of my crew. You got anything on you, bud? Can I sneak attack? Oh no. Oh my crew are just reappearing. Okay, so we like... Or do we auto loot people? Or is that me just like leveling up? I think that might just be me like leveling up. Yeah, that's just me like leveling up a skill. My god, just scared the crap out of me then. Okay. Oh, they are literally just appearing. We're done now, anyway. Okay, put this stuff away. Okay, okay. I wish it just jumps forward like that. Look at this guy. This guy looks cool, too. I must admit, I think one thing that I like looking at this. The graphics that don't look great in my opinion, everything looks like, I don't know, like it's blurry a little bit. I want this actually, what is this? Uh, let's add it to the journal and read it I guess. I'm not going to read that, not right now. <laughs> Can I like, take all of this stuff? Okay, I'm sorry. Right, let's go. Well done. It's grim work, I know. But we can't let the corrupted get entrenched down here. Unfortunately, the numbers seem to just keep growing. Several shipwrecks along the shore, and more by the hour. The storm wall is a fact of life here. It completely surrounds the island, wrecking any ships that approach and any that attempt to leave. But this storm, it's unnatural even by Eternum standards. There must be something, or someone, causing it. Well, I'm getting loads of stuff and I honestly don't know what it means. Uh, so who could be causing it? I'm not sure, but all this wreckage at the same time. It seems like it must be coordinated somehow. We generally see a new shipwreck only once a season, and even then, there are usually more survivors. Um, okay, is that supposed to be like every time there's a new season in game, <laughs> new people come? Okay, it should be search for survivors. Ah, that's likely a lost cause. If they're out there, stuck in the midst of the wreckage, they're probably already corrupted. More importantly, I need to focus on finding the storm source, and I couldn't possibly ask you to go alone. Uh, it's alright, I volunteer. I volunteer as tribute. Well, I fear you may not fully grasp the danger of such an endeavor, but I won't hold you back. Just keep that weapon at the ready, and take out as many corrupted as you can. If you find survivors, send them here. Okay. Oh, look at that person, they look cool too. Um, sorry. Let me have a look and see what this does. Oh, 
Okay, so can I put that in here? Um, and then iron arrows. I guess they can go there and that can go there. Not that I think I have anything to use at all. But there was something about the skills here as well. Um, so we've got character, we've got attributes, we've got leveling rewards. What does this do? Weapon mastery. Trade skills. Attributes. Leveling rewards. Unlock the second weapon start. Okay. So like, what do I do? It requires 50 points. 50 po oh, okay, I've got 8 points. So I can't do anything here at the moment? Anyway. Alright, let's go this way. Such as was alive as the wreckage uh, of the Pride Crater. I don't think this is a sprint. It's been a few, like, actually, I think it's been like a week or two since I've actually played this. And, um, made my character and everything like that. <laughs> it's been quite a while. Uh, let's have a look. Can we have to go this way? Yeah, I think we have to go this way. This is only the beginning. All these sailors join our cause. Soon, it will be all of humanity. Okay, crop to save. Um, at K to purchase upgrades. But I can't, unless I, it's like this. Um, points available. A oh, whirling well blades inflicts. What does this do? Stab attack. Should I unlock that? Okay. Whatever that means. So I've got a new thingy here. So I have a new sword as well. Let's have a look at this. That person is... No, I'm sorry. I thought they were like level 888 then. <laughs> Right, I need to find survivors. Sorry, this guy. Can you give a girl a hand here? These red-eyed rotters have me pinned down. Could I destroy these? Back on the sand. You have my tanks. I know a safe spot this way. Come on. Okay, she looks kind of cool. Anything I can pillage? I feel so, I feel like I look so stupid. <laughs> Wait, who am I following? That's cool. Wait, what is this? Just Flynn? Okay. Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Tell you what a relief it was seeing someone who was still human. I was beginning to think I was all alone out here. The rest of the world had gone mad. Uh, there's actually a watchtower nearby. Perfect. I was betting there'd be some kind of town nearby, thinking I'd go look for it after I'm done out here. But I'm not about to go walking away from a fleet of freshly crashed boats. Not if I have a choice in the matter. <laughs> okay, can you go out? This isn't my first shipwreck, you know. 
One thing I've learned, you have to always think ahead, keep an eye on the horizon. And there's booty to be had here. Countless treasures captain and crew had stashed on board, if you know where to look. Are you looking for those ships? Of course! Not like these rotters care a damn for it, and I'll be needing a new ship, a new crew. That takes coin. In fact, if you want to partner up, I'd split the loose 70 30. Or what the hell, 60 40 even. What do you say? Then we can go ahead to that watchtower of yours. Uh, how about an even split? That's the spirit. It's a deal. <laughs> I need to circle back to my own ship to grab what I can. But there's a wreck over there I haven't searched yet. Find the manifest first, then look for whatever's listed. I'll meet you over there. Fortune smile on you, mate. Okay. Right. I got a new... Oh, how do we get a... a join a faction? No, I didn't mean to press that. Oh my gosh. Sorry. Um, so I got a new sword. Okay. I thought I had a new sword. You don't have enough coin and or repair to repair all items. Okay, I didn't realize I tried to. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, I thought she gave me like a new sword. Um, okay. Um, where are we going? Is this shipwreck over this way? This way then. Yeah, it looked like she gave me like a big ass like buster sword or something. What is this? Uh, let's do add it to the journal and then we'll read it. Uh, Expedition sailed. Okay. Let's just go back for now. Steal from one another, like rats fighting over scraps. Is she talking about me? Okay, we're gonna read the ship's manifest and then search for some stuff. Search the journal and read it. Okay, uh, a handful of unique available items from Paris's gift to soldiers at the new fort. These items include uh, silver candelabra from the court of the late King Henry the Great, a blessed chalice from a Bishop of the Church, and an astrolabe uh, used by. Okay, cool. Um, so we've got to collect these. Oh, there's gonna be bad people on board, right? Oh, it's just a ball. Is it blocking the way? If it's not, we're just gonna leave it. Okay, so this is a candelabra. Nice, very fancy. Um, how do we get over here? I haven't tried to like climb very much, so I don't know if the game has like, you know, you can only climb so much type thing. The other thing is this way, or is it this way? Oh no, the other thing is like inside. And how we get in? I don't know what the noise is. It sounds really weird. So we're just gonna meet her. The balls are well cute. They're just like sleeping. I'm gonna kill them if they're not gonna attack me first. Apart from the first couple that I killed because I needed meat for a quest. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, anyway, anyway. What is all this flint? I don't need that. There you are. I'm oh, okay. starting to worry. More importantly though, what did you find? see here oh yes 
These are definitely worth a coin or two. Soon as we find a town, we'll sell them and split the profit. Okay, so I'm not getting the sword until I actually complete the quest. Never mind. What's in stuff? Unfortunately, I didn't have as much luck as you did. Those damn red eye rotters are swarming all over the wreckage of my ship. I worry it's bad luck leaving behind my own treasures. But I can't get through the bastards. Ah, uh, you want my help? Now there's a good mate. Tough one too, if you're so confident. No complaints, though. Tell you what. If you can get my stuff back, I'll give you a greater share of our profits. 40, 60. Or what the hell, 30, 70. What do you say? Uh, okay, so they're one of them. Most of our cargo was lost at sea, and I got my captain's log on the way out. What's burning me now is leaving behind my ship's flag and my lucky wheel. Get those, and then maybe we meet at that watchtower. Works for me. Okay, cool. I get a blender bust for this one. I want to see about. I keep pressing the wrong button, sorry. Um, and now I got this sword, so. Put in that. Look at me, I look so cool. It's like twice the size as I am, but it's okay. Alright, let's have a look. Who's a level 4? I don't like the dodging in this, it just seems to be shift. Uh, what is this? Well, let's just try and grab all the stuff we need. Got her flag. Search this stuff. Oh look, he he seemed to he left like a little sack. Let's take all of this. back to the watchtower so I'll just like run there I think there's 60 out of 100 at the bottom is like stamina oh my god he's quick okay also immune if he comes out of his hidey hole <laughs> okay let's uh go back across and um, maybe we can actually go this way around and speak to her at the camp do let me know as well like always if you guys would like to see like more of this i haven't like i literally have no idea <laughs> what i'm doing um so yeah do let me know if you want to see some more of this whether it just be like random stuff here and there or whatnot. I'm guessing this does have a sort of main story to it. Um, but yeah, I'm really not familiar with like any of the controls or anything like that. And I've literally haven't moved off of this like area, so I don't know exactly how like big the map is. I mean it looks pretty freaking big. But I don't know if there's any more to it, or whether it is literally just these little worlds. Um, upcoming invasions, I've got no idea what that means. I think I remember reading like when this first came out, it's a big choice or something, what faction or whatnot you choose to go with. I don't know. I have no idea. Right, should we speak to him? 
I guess we have to speak to him and then we get to speak to him. Oh, welcome okay. back, my friend. Glad to see you're still with us. I was elated to meet another survivor, but I feared we lost you in the process. Oh, Grace O'Malley. A real piece of work, isn't she? Can't say I would have wanted to make that trade. Um, okay, complete quest. While you were away, I think I may have located the source of this endless storm. There's a network of sea caves nearby where the corrupted seem to be gathering. Something nefarious is going on in there. I feel certain of it. I wish to see it out. now. There's someone willing to step up. I can't do this alone. I thought perhaps our new friend might join as well, but uh, she's not really the joining type, is she? Okay, I I'll suspect so. you'll be wasting your breath, but give it a go. Why not, right? I'll go ahead and scout out the entrance to the caves. Whether she comes or not, I'll meet you there. Okay, right. Um, we didn't get over. It didn't say that we're gonna get anything for that. Uh, but we did get this. Blunderbuss. We've only got six shots though. Anyway, I think I'll speak to her and then I'll leave this video here. I'm as grateful as can be that you reclaim my flag and all. But don't ask me to go on a fool crusade against those. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm as grateful as can be that you reclaim my flag and all. But don't ask me to go on a fool crusade against those red-eyed demons. I don't need a medal of valor. Just a coin for me, thank you very much. Okay, where will you go? Good old Watcher Lace and Reese says there's a town. I'll head there and sell this loot. I'll set your part aside until you get there. For my part, I'll be saving up for a ship to escape this hellish island. Uh, didn't you hear about the storm war? Oh, I heard a lot of stuff from Watcher Lace and Reese, but I don't believe even half of it. Besides, Captain Grace O'Malley never met a storm she couldn't navigate. I'll find a way. You can come with me, if you like. Um, I'll meet you in town at least. Have it your way, hero. I just hope you don't end up as one of those monsters yourself. Don't worry about me burning you on the loose. You did me a favour and I'm good for it. As long Okay. Right. We'll leave that there. I accidentally shot her. Um... But yeah, I haven't like gone anywhere else. I'm guessing we're just here. I'm guessing this is the town. Okay, so there's actually quite a bit to each section. Oh, we can like fast travel, uncharted, far. Okay, so we have to like chart it to be able to fast travel to it. Uh, tower. Recommend. Okay, so it gives you recommended levels as well. Does this have a recommended level? Claimed. Recommended level 60, okay. What is it? Fishing? Recommended level 60, what the heck? Collect daily rewards three times a day. Resets at 5 a.m. That's kind of cool. So I'm guessing maybe like as I discover things, more things will pop up. Um, but yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm guessing that's how it works. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this video here. The whole like character thing seems really confusing to me. I'm guessing trade skills i don't really have anything achievements pvp so i do have one of these now and i also have one of these so i'm guessing what you do is as you play with them then you get points and then you can put these points into different skills i guess that that's how that works and then i'm guessing it's not just like one skill overall Oh cool, can I have a star for life star? Musket, blunderbuss, I've also got that, so I can be leveling like four items now. Um, okay yeah, cool. Um, this has like an explanation mark on it, but I can't do anything with it. I just got leveling rewards. Unless like there's any way for me to like select these, unless they're just automatic. So then we get a bag thing. Oh, we get a house at level 15. Oh, the ability to purchase my own house. Okay. 
uh, modes, outpost rush, company. Yeah, all of this is just like so confusing to me. My friends, this is empty, sorry. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, okay, so yeah, we've got location and then we've got main story. So these are just like quests. Uh, these are all the quests. No. Are these the quests that they've done? Uh, reset map. Okay, yeah, anyway, uh, you must be level 25 to access seasons. Okay. They do have, like, a store as well. I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna get, like, that is cool. Wait, no, I want to see the store. No, wait, sorry. I'm in ESO mode. I, like, don't know what the buttons are. <laughs> Limited purges. So, yeah, this is cool. Can I rotate? Um, hold camera to rotate. Yeah, that's cool. But it's like, get marks of fortune. So I'm guessing they're the currency. Should we see how much they cost? So wait, what is it I need? I need 15,000. Okay, so about that for one outfit. That's still not great, but it's definitely better than like the paleo game. <laughs> oh man, this is isn't this like an Amazon game? Anyway, death drop emote. So we get emotes. There's like apparel skins. What's this? Kind of cool. Okay. I'm not seeing anything else. Great. <laughs> That thing looks super great. Oh, that one's kind of cool. What else do we got? And apparel skins. Okay, so we've got weapon skins, camp skins. So they don't seem to have very many, like, outfit ones. Which I'm guessing is a good thing. Because then it means you won't spend money on it. I don't know. <laughs> we've got tool skins. We've got housing stuff. Oh my gosh. So cute. Oh my gosh. How cute was that? Sorry. How cute was that? Housing items. What is this? Oh these are cool. Oh I like this one. Oh, that one's really cool. Okay, yeah, because there's like there's housing stuff in this. I remember, I'm pretty sure, one of you mentioned something about housing in this. Uh, like a bunny? How to use? You can place housing items in housing decoration mode when you are in your house. Okay, so it doesn't like follow you around or anything like that. See, the 23... Okay, so you're paying 16 quid for all of this stuff. I don't really think that that's a good deal. Sorry, I don't know why everything ever turns into me freaking looking at microtransaction shit. <laughs> anyway, right. Um, yeah, anyway, I'm going to leave this video here. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just pressing buttons. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this. If you would like to see me play some more of New World, then do let me know in the comments. Um, and I'll definitely play some more. Whether it will be carrying on from this moment, I don't know. Maybe it'll be like a little bit down the line. Um, but yeah, first impressions, it looks okay. Um, the graphics are okay. The characters just look a little bit like blurry to me. That person's chopping down trees. Oh, well that's the point. Will I get an axe or something at some point? I'm guessing I will do. Um, oh my god! I want this hammer. Sorry. Can I have this hammer? We'll just grab this as well. I want this. A war hammer. Nice. I'm guessing other people who don't have it can come along and grab it too. 
My Jesus Christ, look at the freaking size of that thing. That is huge. I feel like a Thor on steroids. Okay. <laughs> that's so... I mean, that's got to weigh, like, a lot. No? That is funny. Okay, anyway. Thank you guys so much. It would weigh her down so much. She's gonna like fall on her ass. Anyway, thank you guys so so much. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Hit the like button, leave comments, don't forget to subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you all in the next video. Take care, bye.